This is a first edition of Tenders of the Night by F. Scott Fitzgerald. My name is Pom Harrington and I'm the owner of Peter Harrington. So what makes this a first edition and why is this book special? Let me show you. Um, very simply, to tell a book as a first edition, um, we're going to look behind on the back of the dust jacket. Sorry, the back of the title page. Um, the title page says very simply, Tenders of the Night, so Romance by F. Scott Fitzgerald published in New York by Charles Scribner's 1934. But the details of the printing on the reverse, and publishers use many different ways of signifying a first edition. Um, for some reasons, Charles Scribner's decided to use a capital A, which is here. Um, that indicates it's the first printing. If that A is missing, you have a later printing, straightforwardly. So we do know this is the first printing. Now, the jacket itself was a little bit controversial. Um, T.S. Eliot clearly wrote some kind words about this novel, um, but sadly they never asked his permission. Um, but in the first edition, if you look on the inside flap or the dust jacket, there is a, um, a, a nice little paragraph here by T.S. Eliot. I've been waiting impatiently for another book by Mr. Scott Fitzgerald with, with more eagerness and curiosity than I should feel towards the work of any other contemporaries except that of Mr. Ernest Hemingway. Well, sadly, that quote was done without permission, and Mr. Elliot was not very happy and asked for it to be withdrawn. So from subsequent printings, um, that blurb is missing. So we know the jacket is a first printing. Um, the just jacket is very rare. Um, it was, 1934 was a time period when people didn't really keep dust jackets, and they were normally discarded. Um, if it was kept, the book was read, and often the jacket fell apart. Um, this actually is a very for want of a better word, pleasing example. Um, I'm going to open it up and you can see the jacket's pretty much all complete and there's a touch of fading to the red on the spine, but um, overall you have to say it's a very attractive copy of the jacket. Um, we're going to look just at the book underneath and you'll see that the book is also a fine copy, which you would expect. So in all, we have a very nice copy of the first edition, first printing, in the first state dust jacket of Tender as the Night. For details of this book and others, please check our website.